It's not rocket surgery. Let's have a chat about overtaking. Now you'd think since the Hume Highway and the Pacific Highway are now dual lane the entire way. You've got from Beresfield through to Heatherbray and you've got Coffs Harbour, but it's still dual lane the entire way. You'd reckon it wouldn't be that hard to overtake. But thanks to a bunch of numpties and speed limiters, the number of times you catch something and you cannot get round it because the bloke driving the other truck has got the blinkers on, you're looking straight ahead, I'm not gonna look in that mirror, I've got my foot buried in the floor and there's no way I'm giving an inch. Why? Why? You've got 15 minutes of having a truck sitting right next to you. The lanes are only as wide as a truck. You're asking for trouble. There have been several accidents, one of them fatal, that I've been aware of personally, where if the guy on the left, being overtaken, had recognised the fact he was going to be passed and just backed off for a couple of moments, everything would have been fine. But no, you put yourselves in danger by keeping into it. So let's talk about etiquette. What should you do? You're watching your mirrors. They're those glass things on the side of the truck, kind of reflective. You can see what's behind you. So you're looking at it every now and then and you'll notice something that might be coming up behind you. Now, it might only be catching you slowly, slowly, slowly over time, but it is catching you, which means it will catch you and it will pass you. So when old mate pulls out to overtake, if you haven't had the courtesy to actually call him up on the radio and say, I'll back it off for you, old mate, bring around. When old mate pulls out, why not back it off cruise? Knock it down, you know, 10, 15 kilometres an hour just for a couple of seconds. Touch the brakes even. Passing whatever happens, pass like that, back into it, everyone's happy. You haven't got a truck sitting next to you, there's no fight, there's no problem, everyone's happy, it's a feel good moment and you're safe. Now I practice what I preach, I do this every time. If I'm being passed, if I've got a truck approaching me, I try to call him, if I can't get a response, as soon as he moves out into the other lane, I always touch the brakes just to show the brake lights to give him an indication of what I'm doing. So I can back it off 5 or 10k an hour, make the passing manoeuvre easy, he gets passed, give him a flashback in, everyone's happy. What's the big deal? You've lost 10, 15 seconds?